hello guys. We're back again on the hunt for some gold in Southern Oregon. Even sunnier day than usual. And I think I'm in a predicament. I left my sunscreen and the mosquito spray at home. And I didn't put any on. And I'm gonna be out here longer than I usually am. I'm so close and yet I still have another 30 minute hike to get down to where I need to go. Unfortunate. In my favor. I left a pan at home too. I left my super sluice. Deer just ran up the hill. Right now we're on my old campsite. Uh, my buddy and I, we set this up. We had to leave because there was a cougar that was chilling during the night right by the campfire. But we set up a couple nifty things around here. We have, we call this Poop Alley. We dug this straight into the bushes. Got ourselves our little poop hole. Nothing's in there, don't worry. But we also set up this nice little privacy barrier. Just drove a couple sticks in the ground, lashed them together, filled her up. We have the camping area. And the staircase down to the creek. out it wasn't a cougar it was just a ringtail having a fight with the cat so uh, we made it back to the river and it is hot so I'm gonna get to hydrating already with water or with dark blue Gatorade. I think I'm gonna go with Gatorade. I was gonna try to hike around this bend in the river, but I kind of get cut off a little bit. I don't think I can get over there, or at least not safely. So I decided I'm gonna work this crack right here. Hopefully, it turns out pretty good. There's a lot of uh, plants growing in here. Hopefully those cracks are breaking up the bedrock a little bit. I'm gonna start right about here. This is a lot harder to get this root out than I thought it was gonna be. It's in there really good.
log a lot more than I like sitting on this rock. Couple of pieces. So it came back to my crevice. It's more of a hole now. I'm just punching a giant hole in this bedrock. But what I'm doing is just busting all this bedrock up. Because I'm finding, I don't know if you can see it very well, but it's probably just hiding in these super tiny cracks. Well, very good amount for what that crack has been producing. Uh, we might need to start looking for something different. So we've moved up to a new crack. Let's see if we can work our way underneath this boulder somehow. Let's see what's in there. Should I did a test pin from here earlier today and I had decent colors and I only put a very small amount in my pan so let's get a full one and see what she comes up with. I'm sitting in the cave taking another hydration break and it's so hot outside but it's so relaxing and nice in this little cave. It got me thinking about the movie Holes where um, Zero and Stanley Yelnats they're way off in the desert and they find shelter underneath that capsized boat that used to be the onion cellar. Uh, reminds me of reminds me of that scene. These gravels are packed in here pretty good. Hopefully this crack pays off for me. I have good hopes for this crack. Um, a lot of this bedrock is fracturing down in there. A couple good pieces in here. I think that crack's gonna pay off for us. I'm trying to find a little bit of shelter from the wind, but this crack that I was working is a lot easier to work than the first crack, the one that I started digging in a hole into. Um, so I'm thinking I might stick here for a little bit, but I'm also wanting to go back to that spot I found all that flower gold in. Even though I really don't want to separate that from the black sand, I kind of want to... This sounds fun. I don't know. I'm not sure what I'll do yet. I might look around for a new spot as well.
my snuffer bottle back up here. got my good shoes wet and I just said eh, and kept them wet so today was a long hot day but I found some pretty good gold I'm pretty happy with that got a good look at the land around I'm thinking tomorrow I'm gonna go even farther up the river somewhere I haven't been before just to see what's there see what I can see you know but as of right now halfway through my hike home 